Santana was amazing, but we left early. Why did you leave early? Eric's fucking mom made us leave early. Why? Because she's old as fuck and doesn't like fun. I don't know. She was there with y'all? Yeah, yeah, she was on my ride, so I had no choice. Uh, That was funny. Damn. But I'm... That... I got logic all over again. Uh. For context, uh... We left early for Logic and it tainted the show for me. Oof, yeah. The same thing happened last night. I left night. early for 21, but I don't remember leaving. Yeah, I, bet you did. I, I bet you don't remember that. Nope, I do not. But basically, yeah, uh, it's alright, they're not going to watch this podcast. I'm, I'm a little pissed off about it, I won't lie to you. Because that, it was, the way the show was going, it was definitely had potential to be one of the best shows I've seen in a long time. I left Red was like getting good too like Red was getting good yeah I didn't get to stay for any of the big big hits uh, I mean maybe one but that was about it that? oh it's incense yeah we have incense lit down here I fucking hate that smell well the basement is a little smelly right now because there was a bit of a leak yeah, last weekend but we did not talk about yeah I didn't even smell I walked in here I saw I smelled first I smelled bacon then I smelled yeah I smelled bacon. bacon yeah we made bacon for breakfast upstairs yeah like first I smoked bacon, I smoked incense. Right? Yeah, but this is my breakfast. What I will say about Breakfast of Champions, it is. What I will say is though, the show was fantastic for Santana's part because it was a little different. He didn't sing or say anything the entire time we were there. He was just playing the guitar the whole time, and there was other people there that were singing like the lyric songs. Oh. Which was very different, and I'm assuming. I seen your video. It looked like you were just sitting there. Did he, he was sit sitting most of the time. Thing? He was. He got up sometimes. Well, he was mostly sitting. He's old, ain't he? Yeah, he's older, so I guess it makes sense. But here's the thing. No excuse, because Mick Jagger can still run back and forth at the. Back yeah, and but here's, forth here's on the stage. Thing. They took no seven, breaks. Six. It was just like a constant flow from one song to the nice. next. Damn. Like there was no breaks in between, so. I guess it makes sense why he was sitting then. He did not take a single break the entire time we were there. I mean, when, like, there was no guitar parts, obviously, but, like, it just, there was no, like, how y'all doing tonight? Good, all right, awesome. No, it was just constant music being played, which was kind of cool That's and, and different. Yeah. But I couldn't tell you how it concluded. Well, I've been, yeah. I've been, I've been the band, like, a couple shows where they actually fucking just play straight through. Yeah. They come on, they do their shit, and leave. Yeah, it was it was very different, and I wanted to see how it what it is out, because if you st- they stop, take time to talk to the crowd, how are you guys doing, mm-hmm. and all that, you're not fitting it. More, more songs, songs yeah. like they're trying to jam in as many songs as they can in one, mm-hmm. like an hour or so. Which I respect. A lot of bands do that because one, like people are paying to see you play live, so might as well give them as much songs as you can. Yeah, and I like that mentality. It's different from like the average band, which I do respect when they talk to you and like actually are down to earth with the fans. But like, yeah. it's cool to see where they're just like, all right, we're serious, serious now. I heard I heard uh, Taylor Swift talks most of her fucking show. Well, she's got three freaking days at each show, so yeah. she can afford to do that. Three days at a show. I think so. Last yeah, time she was at the lake, of... it was a three day event. Yeah, and there was a fucking crowd outside. Three day event. That's insane. Yeah. And the people will buy it. These are weird. Yeah. They are insane. They are powering the economy right Can't now. Can you imagine that? Like, I don't think they ever heard her until it's their song. Like, what? Just to see how many people that like like her. Like, wait, I was, wait, what? 
I was about to say, you've never heard of... I mean, I've heard of Taylor Swift. Oh, well, I was about to say, what the fuck? Her shit, like her newer shit. Like, oh, her newer shit. Nobody listens... I swear, it's bots. Like, I... I know, that's I, what I'm saying. But I know it's has, not, but I swear it is. Has to be bro, bro. I've seen a video of a girl dressed up as a friendship bracelet. What? Like, yeah. What does that mean? I don't know. She gives out, like, friendship bracelets or some shit. Like, she's in fucking kindergarten. Who, Taylor? Yeah. Was it them like bracelets that like connect? Like those fucking. Um, oh, I th- I've seen the those. Fucking oh, um, like the beaded bracelets. You got Google it. You no. Know what I'm about. Uh, yeah. I know exactly what Taylor's you're talking about. French li- bracelets or some shit. Like the Swifties are fucking insane about that. Yeah. Like no, a little beat, like it. That was no. that. Oh no. Okay. That's not it. Okay. No, it's literally like something you buy at a craft store. Like a beaded like bracelet. Like that. No, uh, something like that. Let me just scroll down. Any of these look familiar? No. Okay. Maybe. Oh, wait, wait. Something like that. Oh, okay. Kind of. Yeah, like, it looks like, it, it looks like someone made it. Like, yeah, it's an Etsy ad. You're dressed up as the hell are you dressed up as I don't fucking know. I've seen a video of someone who was like, was like. Yeah, how do you dress up as a freaking. A friendship bracelet? A bracelet. I don't know, yeah, so I don't know how you dress up, but someone did it. Swissies are weird. That's crazy. You buy one of these for six ninety five. Honestly, I, I can't wait for the day that uh, Trav, her and Travis break up. That'd be funny as shit. Damn, wishing on their downfall like that. <laughs> it's gonna happen. I want the Chiefs' downfall. I mean, so does the rest of the NFL world. But because that's all their fans. Yeah, no, so like it is, uh, all it is, is Swifties. They don't know football. Chiefs fans now. Yeah, I mean, I do know genuine Chiefs fans, but like. There's definitely a lot of fairway fans just because one they're really good to Taylor Swift, yeah. And Swifties. That's all it is right now. Bandwagons and fifty Swifties. I feel bad for any of like the Chiefs that have been around forever. It's like this is our fan base now. That went the ones that've been around for their fucking their drought, their half century of pain. Hey, yeah. you know what? Let the Chiefs have their fun, because once it's done, they're going to be in another half century drought, probably. Yeah, they're the Patriots right now. Yeah, the Patriots are dead. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. Cool. and they they didn't win shit until like Brady came there. Yeah, they went to two Super Bowls. They lost both of them, but then Brady came and you know what happened? That started the dynasty. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. The dynasty of all dynasties. It's crazy. Oh, talk. Since we're on football now, football, football, football. What's up? Uh, Monday night, Jason Kelsey gets uh, he gets the games on on Monday nights. Oh, he does. Yeah, he broadcasts on uh, Monday night football. Yo, let's oh, go. Shit. I think he does gets. <coughs> <coughs> Damn. Thursday too. I think he gets Thursday. I don't know. Oh, he also gets the wild card game. Apparently, at least one of them. Yeah. Yo, let's go, Jason. Oh, he also has his own uh, hoagie at Wawa, too. Him and his wife have their own signature. Did you try it? I tried the Jason. It was good. It's just, Jason? A, it's just an Italian with a... Uh, <laughs> yeah, it's, it's called the Jason. Uh, it's, a, it's like the Kelsey Classic or something. Yeah. What's his, his wife's called? Uh, I mean, Kylie. Yeah, the Kylie. Kylie. The Kylie. Oh, my gosh. That's funny. But, yeah, his is pretty much just an Italian with, like, some uh, peppers on it. It was good. Are you guys talking about... Remember... Like a couple weeks ago, it was like around Memorial Day. Kylie was about to drop like Yo, some crazed fan. I saw. I was just about to say that. Like because they, they were like they were like pressing them at like their short house. Yeah. And, shit. and like was, a picture Kylie was like, I don't give a fuck who you are. Right. Like, like we're on vacation. Leave us like, alone. Which like you lost the thing, like bitch. Fuck. Like I don't care. <laughs> like, yeah. Said, she said something. She went off on the people. Person. Don't understand their boundaries with. Of people. celebrities, like, you know, just people, people in general. Yeah, yeah. That's what I'm saying you gotta understand, like they're humans too, just like you. Like they don't want to take a picture with you. Like they don't want to take. A like they don't want to take a picture. Me. Don't get all uptight for people too. They don't have the yeah. right to do it. And then get mad over that. Like that's some like weird shit. Like get mad over yeah. that because I don't want to take a picture with you. Like come on, that's weird. Yeah. Shit. Like get yeah, they're they're basically Philly legends right now. Like yeah. like oh, yeah, I just they're imagine. Philly legends. The the whole family. Mm-hmm. So, like, imagine that person now. They want the but, rest like, of they had pissed off and they're like. How you live the rest of your don't life? Support him. Yeah, don't support him. Yeah, like, like they were with their, they were with their fucking young daughters, like just on vacation, and people like pressed them. It was like, oh, can we get a picture? Like all that. Like and like the apparently the way they did it, like they were fucking like disrespectful, kind of. So Kylie went off. Yeah. Yeah, you got. She's just treat them like normal people. They're just like you and I. She's literally no different. She's a like. Definition of a Philly girl. 
Yeah, it doesn't give a fuck. She, she, she don't. Yeah, yeah, no. That's good she has that though, you know what I mean? It's mm-hmm. to get the hell away from her. Yeah, yeah, I do what you gotta do these days, especially because like you don't know if they're crazy. Exactly. Like no. they could do some fuck shit and no, literally, yeah, literally. They like they're like on their property and like that's an even worse. Like, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. like, like get the fuck off my property. Now you're arguing with somebody on their property. Over yeah, the it was like I don't like, know who you are. Like fucking yeah, niece. I don't care who you are. A picture, bro, over a picture. Like come on. I think it was over a picture of autographs. Like, I feel like they were like disrespectful. Autographs even, like, autographs like, even worse. Like, yeah. <laughs> autographs even worse. Like, it would be cool like just to be in the bar and like sexy and know you look right over. Fuck, that's yeah. Jason Kelsey. Yeah. You know, like, yo, I gotta, I gotta chug a beer with this motherfucker. You know, uh, UFC, you know who we seen at the bar? Who? Um, you know, Joe Pfeiffer. Joe Pfeiffer. I don't know that. Philly Cat. Jersey Philly Cat. No, I don't know. We seen him at Hots and shit. They fucking one time there. It was Crazy. My sister like, thinking, you know, like you think of like, damn, like we're in this bar, like if somebody get that first prompt, you probably actually kill somebody. Yeah. Like, My sister seen. seen um, like, <laughs> it was. Uh, oh, I know you're gonna say. You talking about was it Ayu? No. No, was Isaiah Ayu. Pacheco. No. Yeah, it was Pacheco. My oh, sister shit. served him. Oh shit. Because he literally. he went to uh, Vineland. Oh, so he was okay. at Rats, high school. and my sister was like, because his buddy was like, ordering the drinks for him, he wasn't saying anything, trying right. to be like low key. Yeah, trying to be low. And like his buddy was hyping him up, like, you know who this is? He's a football player or something. And Riss literally went up to him and was like, I'm not gonna fuck if you play football. Wait, why is your buddy, like, you order your shit. Right. And uh, someone said, like, right and someone told him, was like, that's Isaiah Pacheco over there. And she goes, oh. And went over and went, Fuck the Chiefs. Go Birds. <laughs> <laughs> right to his face. She's definitely got something to yeah. say. She's mostly got your dad's attitude. She's like a Philly girl, too. Mm-hmm. We don't even live in Philly. <laughs> We're close enough. <coughs> we go to Philly every so often, so. Yeah, I live close to yeah. Philly. Like, you know, dude, I live like 15 minutes jog, like what, 30, 35? Yeah, that, it's like 25, 30. 25. Depending on how the traffic, traffic is, yeah. yeah. You'd be surprised how close it is, like, or you could see Philly, like certain parts of my like where I live, like certain mm-hmm. roads, you can see like the skyline and shit. It's crazy how close I live now to like yeah. that side over there. And it feels like it's not that far. It's yeah. weird though. It feels like it's like it's just weird, like the area out of it and shit. It's just it's right, right there. Yeah, yeah it's right there. And it, when when she said fuck the cheese and go go, go birds to Pacheco. What's up? What's up? Was uh was right I think it was the it was the like the bye week before we had to play the Chiefs. So like, oh, was that? Yeah, I thought it was, it was like the bye week. He was going for the bye week. Oh, okay. And I feel like I don't. Oh, wait, you're right. Yeah, yeah. Wait, yeah. before yeah. the bye week one, you and AJ are Scott Rocket and DJ. You know, like the dishonorable words. Ah, well, yes, yeah, it's, it's fine. We'll get set chairs. Uh, oh, I ain't showing. Oh. Jake's a peasant. <laughs> Fuck off. Oh, for the uh, another another sports thing is hockey though. Oh, shall we talk but it's about not, the meme? No, oh, you got something else to talk about? Oh, wait, what are you talking about? Oh, you, oh, you go first. first. You go first. The girl that flashed. Oh, oh yeah. what she about got, her? She got offered a, she's a, no, a Playboy model. Oh, that actually went through? Yeah, she actually yeah. accepted being a Playboy model. Well, well, she Different denied her. She denied all the fucking, uh, she denied all the fucking yeah, she did, she did, she did. offers she was getting from porn companies. Yeah, it was like probably like a couple, like a week or two ago. Like she was actually yep, a there it is. Like, like, I don't she know was her name, but yeah, it's Kate. Yeah, it went viral over it. She's, yeah, she's, she's got some like Playboy shit. Like, yeah, she's in Playboy. The Oilers would love to charm. Yeah, either you get banned for life. You get for how it works out. Yeah, it's if you're hot, you actually get something. If you're not, then you get banned. Well, there you go. That, there, that's there. why she was getting so many offers. She like I think she porn got offers and shit as well. Yeah, I think like Pornhub and Brazzers fucking offered her a job, of course and she is. like denied it. I think OnlyFans was even trying to get her or something. Well, OnlyFans is different because you just do your own thing on there for but the most part. You know what's, you know what's you crazy? You only sign contracts. What's up? You know what's crazy about like the world like that? Like how like something so silly that was meant as a joke can like change your life in a good way. Like without yeah, even, like, like the, breaking out like realizing like, 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 like as far as like money wise and like shit like that, like like her doing that could have just changed her life forever. It could have even, it didn't even have to be like something like that her. too. It's just the most random things you do. That's what like I'm saying. People Anything on the internet can, making like yeah, a like, stupid like Vine or TikTok or something. People still know their names to this day because it's something stupid they said ten years ago. Like, yeah. I wouldn't be surprised. Look at the girl now. That, that the one girl. Yeah, yeah, that's what I'm yeah. saying. I wouldn't be surprised if she somehow gets interviewed somewhere somewhere. She got interviewed and now she's like. 
famous. But, like, famous. That's crazy, bro. Like, all because she went, you just got a hawk too. Now she's probably, yeah, it's <laughs> A hawk too. My, my fucking instructor right, was talking about that shit. Say some funny shit. Hopefully it goes viral. And that shit ain't gonna go viral. You don't know that. You never know. I mean, she didn't think she would, but I guess now look at everybody. Knows she was also hammered. Yeah, so. Okay, well. so you do the same and throw <laughs> Yeah. So far, results have been mixed. <laughs> Tomorrow or July 6th, if you get hammered, take me to Jake to say some funny shit. Just shoot. carry a GoPro around that day. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just catch some ice. We do a beach morning. thing tomorrow. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Do we figure out what we're doing? Oh, yeah. We're on the brig. Apparently, we're doing a brig. That seems to be the consensus. Well, the also, start. I pretty much. George wanted to go to Strathmere or like the fucking seawall on the brig. I was like, no, we're going to the beach, dude. We're not going to the fucking bayside. Like, yeah. We're going down to the beach, so they're not doing the seawall. What is that, like, we all, like, rocks That's the bay, yeah. Uh, He's like, we could go to the seawall. I was like, no, we're doing the beach. I'm sure he'll just be happy to be there. Yeah, I don't care. No, no, he's going to be all pissy because we're not doing what he wants to do. (laughs) Damn, I'm going to call him out harder. Uh, What the hell is he doing? You don't. Uh, yeah, there's there's just... So I guess we'll talk about the other hockey thing. Oh, good show. The fact that last week we were talking about this uh, the Stanley Cup Finals, and uh, it's at Game Seven. The Panthers were up three to nothing series, and now it's Game Seven. They're they're about to get reverse sweeped. This is the biggest meme of all time. I, I hope this Edmonton happens. sweeps them. Has it ever happened in the NHL? Uh, it's happened it a couple happened, times, but never in the final. Is the final. I feel like that shouldn't happen to you in the finals. Like it shouldn't happen you at can all. Get to a three zero. If lead. you're about to sweep someone, yeah. you should fucking finish it. No, they didn't. They fucking they choked. And also, Connor McDavid turned into Connor McJesus and went off. Yep, he came. every game. Did he break that assist record? Uh, Let me look it up I real think quick. he did. Yo, AJ. What's up? This is fucking like an old school. Like like it's a keg. It's a kegerator. Oh shit. I always wonder what this was. I always seen it and just thought it was a table, but then I'm not actually really looking at it. I'm yeah, like, I never it's not actually a table. Like, what is it? It's a table. Oh, he broke the Gretzky record for assists. Nice. I've been looking at it since I was a young kid, and now I'm like finally like realizing, like, what is this? Like, twenty <laughs> something years later, I'm like asking you now. Like, they got it working. It yeah, works right? still. We just don't ever we have a keg. Yeah. Keg I, 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 I think we talked about keg, actually. Fuck it. We talked out. about getting like a half keg or something, and we never did. <laughs> How do you do Bush that? Where are you going? Bush in there, Jake. Any other store. store. Jake, they have pegs, yeah. Some Bush in there. Yeah. <laughs> some bush. Just throw some Bush in there. Something that people would like. Like, everyone would like. Bush is a good... Bush ain't bad. It tastes yeah. like water, and it gets you feeling good. Yeah. I think. It's cheap. Yeah, I was going to say, it'd be cheaper for a keg of that. Fucking $3 for a fucking... Take of that shit. Like, oh. And he's also five points away from breaking Gretzky's points in a playoff run. Well, that'd so, be a lot of points to get in one game, but... Yeah, he'd have to get... Uh, this was two days ago, so he might... If he got more points last night, then... It's cool. obviously... Excuse me. It's obviously closer, but... There's that. So here it is, the... <clears throat> so if you swan it, I accepted my first president of Facebook. I never added him. Let's go. I guess he accepted that. Four teams in the Stanley Cup playoffs have come back from, an, from a reverse sweep. But only one time has ever happened in the finals... And it mm-hmm. was in 1942 wow. when the Maple Leafs came back down 3 0 to defeat the Red Wings. So it's at least happened in the it's NBA. It's happened once. Never happened in the NBA. I yep. Don't think. NBA, it's never happened. I don't think it's happened in any series in the NBA, right? Let alone, let alone I don't the final. Like, like a reverse sweep? Yeah. I don't think there's ever I don't been think a it's ever happened. It's, it's never happened. It's the same two fucking teams every year. No, it's not. And they're not anymore. We're past like that era. No, no, the like NBA I, was fucked when we were in. I didn't watch it because I didn't want to watch the fucking Celtics win. Oh yeah, I didn't watch the fu- after game one. I'm like, yep, this series. I is forgot over. game whatever it was was even happening until the next morning when I saw they won. Oh yeah, I knew the game was happening and I'm like, they're gonna win. And then I came back on in the internet a couple hours later. The Celtics win their 18th championship. I'm like, boo. And. Yeah, the NBA is starting to become fucked again. Not really, but just kind of. They were the best team. They did deserve to win. Whatever. I don't care. It just could have been a more interesting matchup other than the Mavericks, I feel like. Like, there were other teams Any that other should team have done better had than a run. run. Made it more interesting. Luka's a bitch. He will always be a bitch. Yeah, I've never really liked Luka. People either hate him or ride his dick. I'll run it, Loki. Is he? 
Isn't Kyrie on the Kyrie on the Celtics? I mean, I can understand it. No, Kyrie is on the. I don't like that. Yeah, he just don't got the like. He still have the like. He don't want to be there. Like he's there, but like. Then I was watching that thing where he was like, apparently, like he never really wanted to play basketball. He was kind of forced into it. <laughs> Since it's going to be so hot, he's already built for it, so he just yeah. got good at it. You know what I mean? That's like it's going to be too. so hot yeah. today. While he's the same way. Golfing is crazy. But my one buddy he goes, my yeah, plan today is to stay off the fairway so I can keep cool in the shade. Like, I hope he normally want to try and stay on the fairway. Past playoff runs in later years and handles it better. So I found it. The NBA has never had a reverse sweep ever in any round. I didn't think so. There's just been close a couple times. There's been a couple times where they've forced a game seven after being down 3-0, but they've never won it. So it's happened in the MLB once too. When the really? Cavs beat the Warriors the one year though, weren't they down like three one or something? Or like they came yes. back from a big deficit. They were. It was a three to one deficit. That was a crazy year. Yeah, the MLB had it. The 2004 ALCS. This is a very famous. Oh, I one. just got this. The Red Sox. Reverse swept the Yankees oh, after yeah, being down, and then they went on to win the World Series. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, they did. Their first win in almost a hundred years. There's about thirty for thirty about that. Yeah, years. Yeah. Year you get this. Get what? No. I'm. There's just a picture of these two guys. Is there something to get? Yeah, is there something to get? No, it's C J Hawk and. Hawk to Oh my yeah. god. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I, I didn't get it at first. I was like, wait, I don't really know that guy. I was like, why is there a picture of Tua in a Bengals player? And then they just said <laughs> CJ Falk. I was like, ah, Falk Tua. Freaking Falk Tua. I've never even heard that before, to be honest. You I never just heard saw something about it this morning on my phone for the first time. Is it a time. new thing? Well, yes. It was some Hawk video Tua or whatever. Yeah. Like that video of the chick. Yeah, yeah, I never, I I never see seen the video. No. I don't even. I just heard it, about dude, it. Dude, all you gotta do is just go on, in, go on Instagram or TikTok, and you'll she'll pop up. Yeah, yeah I found her already. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. People got like I seen somebody put, like made a card like you know you get custom cards. So it was like a cash app card or some card. It literally is like the picture of her like doing the face as she was like saying it, and it just says "Hawk too." And the card, I'm like, that's crazy. People are just going to put. They're going a little crazy now. I don't know how. Everything. They made random, random ass things. The, like I seen a. Of like, because people were trying to find who she is. Yeah, so and yeah. like she was, like, one of the spots, like some like fair or something. I don't know what it was. Had Hawk two 2024 hats, and yeah, she yeah. was there signing them. That's crazy. <laughs> who the fuck was, was that? She was I, I, I don't she know. Was about that video. Yeah, she was like, like I think she's owning it up now. Yeah. Oh yeah, she's owning it. She's getting. She's famous. According to this oh. article, yeah. I mean, it probably is embarrassing for like people that you know, like right, seeing the right, video right, and yeah. stuff. But. Like your parents. She has an interview yeah. releasing, yeah. releasing like, oh God, a bit tomorrow. tomorrow. And what? <laughs> she got an interview with somebody, and it is they're releasing the full thing tomorrow. <laughs> so the there you go, internet. Is it the full interview or just yeah, the full one? I don't oh. know if there's been snippets released in here and there. Well, the only one that the the snippet that's been viral is the her going Hawk to it. <laughs> okay, that's about. It. That's All about it. it. <laughs> so she'll be forgotten in about a month. So that's yeah. what I've learned from this. Well, I've been on the internet long enough. Yeah. Well, my favorite meme right now is the, oh no. Hey, that oh, one's no. still going strong. No, now the Hulk 2 yeah. is fucking, it's taken over that. I guess. I don't go on the internet enough, I guess. You I do. Know. I don't know. Maybe it's because I don't have TikTok. Yeah, I was going to say. That might just go on Instagram Reels. because it, I don't like, like short form I don't use Reels, really. <laughs> I don't like use a, reels either. I get I get stuck there just one mindlessly scrolling and shit like that. Yeah, threads. What is that? It's like a whole other app or something. It's shit. like their rip off of Twitter that nobody uses. Uh, no, no, see, every time I see I try to click it, it makes me try to download the app. Does like, anyone here yeah, have threads? threads? I think Lynn does. I have threads. How is that? It's all right. It's like tame Twitter. Tame Twitter. Yeah. It's like I don't have Twitter anymore because it's fucking weird. So. It's all right. It's just the I same shit, basically. I always get the notification yeah. saying, this person, this person, and this person want to add all you on like, no. no. Is it cap though? So. I feel like it's cap. They're just listing some of your followers and yeah. saying that they want to add you on threads. Yeah. Cause well, I was like, they can't something. add you if you don't have an account. They wouldn't be able to But do I get notifications saying these people want to add you no. on threads. It's just They don't even show pull. up. Your account don't even show up. Yeah, yeah. it's fake. It is fake. It doesn't happen. It's stupid. It's fucking you're already posting the same shit on the gram, so it's like, why if I'm running down a whole nother ad? Oh my god. Yeah, like, 
I don't need any more social that. media than yeah. the few That's that I use. Wild. Yeah, I'm oh, like, yeah. at the point in life where I don't care. I don't need to join new ones. Yeah. I'm well established on the ones I have already. <laughs> yeah. So I. You get that right. Yeah. You probably, you guys probably don't get that. Sure. They got reverse sweat that yeah. thing. I definitely don't really watch. Oh my god! Yeah, look, 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 not even, not even fucking two, two oh. swipes and there she, there she is. Bro, I don't get it. It's because they're listening. The algorithm is listening. Yeah. Oh, look, Taylor Swift and Travis Kelsey popped off, too. Oh, uh, we were talking about that, too. Yeah, what the fuck? All right, Jay, what else is on there that we've been I talking about? More hockey. Oh, look, another hop to a thing. I feel like this I feel like no. this podcast just been talking about what's in your For You page. Yeah. So let's change it up a bit and talk about something that isn't in your For You page. What is it? I read so fucking barely a porn star <laughs> As a social media says, porn star Samantha Mack and Ryan Dude, Keely crazed Right before Eminem's I exited video out, video. there was another Hulk to it, and then Jason video. Kelsey right on there. I don't even know. Is that a new song I've been in drop? Yeah. Oh, Houdini. Houdini? Houdini? Oh, have yeah. we talked about that on here? Uh-huh. Apparently, porn star for praising to Eminem's Houdini video say it's the biggest moment of our career, I guess. They were in the uh, video. Oh, there was two of them in the video, I think. I don't even know who the fuck they are. Apparently, they're... they're well, now, you, now you'll know. For putting them, put them on. Pretty much Eminem put them on, I guess, and now he's, they're like... Oh, I didn't he have one on one of his videos yeah, back Houdini. in the day too? Yeah, well, it, the the Houdini video is literally it's bits and pieces, like he recreated bits and pieces yeah. from his other videos, like the Slim Shady. It's a nostalgia videos. song for What's sure. What song? Well, the whole like, thing is Slim like Shady's back. Video kind of, it was like oh eight oh ten era. I used to like there was a funny ass song. It was in like um, he dressed up as like. He dressed up as like a bunch of different characters in that funny video. I think it was like Hulk Hogan was one of the characters. I forget the name of the song. Uh, um, he, was that the Rat Boy one? Mm, I don't, the I one don't where know. he dressed up as like Robin from Batman, but it was that's, called it Rat Boy. That's an old one. Yeah. No, no, I mean, it was like 08, 010 like time, bro. It was like a funny video. I can't remember. If I found a video, I would know what it is, but I can't think of the name off of my head. Like, really, hmm. It was a funny ass video. Dude, it's fun. For that, on like TikTok, I get people like Gen Z kids. Saying we gotta cancel Eminem, and people like will stitch you and be like, "You cannot cancel Eminem. Eminem has been around forever and just pissing people off. So you're not canceling." His team these days, though, compared to apparently his new album is what's gonna ruin his career. That's what he's saying. We'll see. Can't cancel now for that. If it is this last album, I just hope it's a good one. Well, I think it's going to be good. So I just have higher hopes for this one than the last <coughs> two albums he's released because he's yeah. got like a whole theme music, going music for to it. be murdered by or something. It was okay. Yeah, it wasn't bad. It was okay. It had it's probably the best one okay since like in the past decade. I like the Kamikaze. It was uh, a, it's kind of aged worse the, it did. the one time gone on. Yeah. Well, that was just a diss track on everyone. Yeah. That whole album. Yeah. It was just him bitching about how people didn't like yeah, revival. Not much worth listening to. Yeah. Kill I mean, shot. There was a good single though that he got Kill shot out for the next well. album. So yeah. <clears throat> uh, speaking of artists, I've listened to most of Stone Stone Sour already. No, do they not have that much? There's only six albums. They don't have too many. Well, the, you're not getting any more albums from. Them. Yeah, no, there we go. Oh. <laughs> yeah, no. Oh, sorry. So, that just derailed the hell out of me. Oh, what was I saying? Oh, Stone Sour. Well, I almost derailed the door. Yeah. <laughs> she swung that shit open. Keep it going, Jake. It might go viral. Maybe, Maybe this might be viral. your moment. Yeah. Fuck no. The <laughs> question he actually goes viral with that, like, uh, some Any stupid joke. shit I said. It's like said some shit. That's how the world works now. Dude. Yeah, constantly yeah, right? reported like, you. There would be at least one thing that you. Could that, go uh, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> There'll be multiple things. No, I feel like <laughs> Sam would be the one to go viral. Like we get him drunk enough, like at a party or something. Let Sam just. Yeah, like, everyone. Sam, Sam will, will be the one. Sure. Let him say something, bro, or like the laugh he says. Like that, I think that. Yo, we were talking about it. We were talking about it. We were talking about it at House of Brews. Devin said Sam still has his high pitch laugh. Right. I think we talked about that last week. He sounds like a man now. Like sounds older, but then when he laughs, he's like that. Like. 
just still got the little kid laugh. I was like, yeah, Sam, it's like the kid just still like pops out of you when you like, it's the funniest shit ever, bro. I was like, I was dying when we were taking a walk. Like, he literally sounds like young bull Sam from back in the day. I was like, yo. Just minus the squeaky voice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just the squeaky laugh. Guys, it's 99%. Get off. Oh, the freaking hoverboard. Hoverboard. <laughs> you still have a video of that, right? I don't have a video of that. I wasn't there that day. Wait, I, don't know. I don't have no. That. You have you have one when he was riding and he was really high pitched. Oh, I have that. Yeah, I but think I, Alex and Robert were there too. They were we have, like fucking babies. We had a video of all of us. I thought like we were all like on the street just chilling, like flying around. I, think. I you, probably you had have, one. I, I like, probably one. have one somewhere. Jake, didn't you have one too? Like played music and shit. Like had Bluetooth speakers. Yeah, I did, and I broke it. Yeah, hoverboard yeah. era. That was a wild era. The That's the one trend. I'm glad my mom didn't give in and buy me one. Yeah, Seth had that off-road one. Yeah. Too, that he'd ride, like, he would ride over. Everybody got one that Christmas, and I was so upset. And then, yeah. like, two months later, nobody rode them anymore. Yeah. So I'm like, okay, I'm glad he didn't buy me one. Because <laughs> yeah. they were the biggest shift from, like, that summer until, like, January. And then I got one off of, like, Alibaba for, like, 40 bucks. But oh. then the battery, like, shit itself. Um, people were saying that, like it, blowing up and shit. Yeah, some of them like the all friend ones were like again yeah, were blowing up. It would just die like when I charge it for hours. I would ride it for like five minutes and then it would just suddenly die and I'd fly off. <laughs> oh shit! Like, I would just stop on you and just yeah, it just locks up. They're yeah. calling hoverboards, but they're not hoverboards. Yeah. No, they're yeah, just they're segways. Not. I don't know why people Segway. call them hoverboards. Oh, that's not. Bad. Oh, now they got they got new ones. You see the new ones? They got the fucking one wheeled ones that go oh, yeah. like forty miles oh, an hour. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Crazy. There it's was a kid wild. that had one of those at Rowan. When yeah, I, I went seen there, the dude. He would just fly around campus to his class. My dad, like, like he went in the right one that zoomed in. Like the dude was like, that's crazy. I seen him. It was a while ago. My dad like was like, "What is that thing?" Because we were going right it or somewhere, and it's all the it's all the dude on it. And he was like asking about it. He's like, "How fast that thing go?" He's like. 25 to 40, he's like, what the fuck? Yeah, on go, one wheel? They go fast. The new electric bikes and electric scooters, they're fast now, man. Mm-hmm. What's the one, um, like, car? What are you like, trying uh, to look for? I'm trying to look for them. What are they called? It's called, like, I don't fucking know. Yeah, like, there we are. I guess right. they are called hoverboard. 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 Yeah, yeah, hoverboard. 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 Electric bikes are dope as shit, though. I wonder how much they cost. Some scooters, bro, they'd be like beating. I'd be watching the one video of the guy, he has one where he'd be beating cars off the line and shit, bro. Shit goes like 60 miles an hour on a scooter. And it's electric, so it's really just. Bro, he's literally like racing Corvettes and shit. I'm like, bro, he's like, I will off the line. Right, on he's a like, scooter? Yeah, That's so funny. Bro, it's scooter, what? bro. Like, I mean, clearly the car is going to, you know, pass him and catch up, but like off the line. Like off, off the, the line. line. He's, going, he's, like, the next to, he's like next to the car. He's like, <laughs> like just going. <laughs> like, I'm just like, yo, it's insane. Like just like taking it off like that. Bro, he picks it up like 0 to 60 and like, uh, I, I'd be scared. I don't even know how that would even like. It's so light, it, bro. and it's an electric motor, so yeah, it yeah. probably uh, passes out for acceleration. Well, that's why. That's why. Uh, that's why Tesla's are like Tesla's yeah. win every time off the line. Yeah, because they don't. You don't have to wait till like the gas to burn. Like, hit the gas the pedal. Process and the that fucking happens. gas to go. Yeah. Even though it does in seconds, but still. I don't yeah. like Tesla because I just feel like. Like you said, like the range no, of the you full charge, just, it's not that far. You only get like two, so maybe like three like gas. Yeah, yeah. yeah, and then you got to put in the factor of using AC or heat and the radio, like all yeah. that shit. Plays and figure out like, where you're going to be going and make sure there's charging stations. Exactly. Like, her a lot of times, like, they won't let you take certain destinations. Tesla drives are just cocky motherfuckers. Like, in range, like, yeah. where you're going. Like, they won't let you take that route. Like, that's crazy. It's weird. Cause then a lot of those spots are like sketchy areas, too. They're like behind like buildings and shit. Like, they're just like weird ass spots for like charging stations. The one, the I seen the one thing. It was a, uh, it was lit. It was lit. I was laughing at it because it was a, uh, a bunch of uh, Tesla charging stations were just, pretty much. It was so hot, like or no, it was cold. They all froze up. So uh, even the batteries oh, were oh. fucking freezing up too. So yeah. a bunch of Tesla drivers couldn't even drive their fucking Tesla. Oh dear, that's not good. You didn't say about that. Oh, no, that was in the I winter when it got seen, really like, fucking like, cold. Like, they all like, just that same type of person. Like they're all the same. They all are. They are. They all they got that like. They don't look not that they're which it's not, but they're just like. They look. I don't know, they just look like. They're just like not real people, bro. They're, they're not like, real. They're not real. They're probably not. Like it just felt like weird, right? They just don't look real, like real people. Like, I got in an accident with a guy in a Tesla. I got out first day of the I was like, "Yo, you all right?" My bad. They're like I rear-ended the guy, but like, <laughs> his, but, and then like he got off. No, he didn't say anything. He just goes, looked at his car, looked at my car, and just said nothing. I was like, okay. 
Sorry? I'm I sorry. Did PC. Like, what the fuck was that shit? You gotta wait for him to load in. I remember I got rear-ended. Yeah, Elon on. didn't. AJ. Elon probably didn't <clears throat> upload. Did I ever tell you that story how I got rear-ended on 55, my, my Hyundai? No, I don't so think like, so. Bro, so I got a crazy story about that. Like, I was using the fucking. Right, so I was driving home. I got the video on my phone, so I'll share that shit, bro. I was driving home from, like, my boy's crib after watching the fights or whatever. Fucking, it was on 55, like, where I used to live and shit. About to get up near the exit near the Spirit Hospital. Yeah. Bro, and I'm driving, right? And my fucking windshield, bro, like, flies up. Like, it's something out of a movie, bro. It's just like, I'm driving, my windshield just like. Oh, your windshield slams up, bro. Destroys my wind, my hood, my hood. My hood. Oh, I was like, your windshield. You're like, what? Hood what? Fly, <laughs> my hood flop, my hood flew up, bro. Destroyed my windshield, bro. So I'm driving on the hot, bro. So I'm like driving on the highway, like probably going 60. My shit is just like covering my entire windshield. So I'm like yeah. looking at the gap, trying to like pull over on the side of the road and shit, bro. I'm like get it down, and my windshield is destroyed, bro. Like smashed to the max. So I was like, oh my fuck. god, bro. I'm like sitting there, I'm thinking like. Plus tomorrow, I'm like, I probably just make it home. Like the exit's right there, and I only live two minutes from there, so I'm just gonna try to go. So I pulled up into the right lane. It's probably going like 40 because I didn't want to hit a bump and that shit fucking cave in on me. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Mm-hmm. So I'm like probably going like 40 in the right lane and fucking, you know, you see cars if you go a little slow, they'll go around you. Like I was just assuming there was a car like that passed me, and then there was another one for it. I'm like, all right, I'm gonna pass me. So looked in the mirror, just kept driving, and then like last second I was just driving, I see like the lights getting closer, and I was like. What the hell? Like seeing it, he wasn't moving, and then just fucking like heard like brakes, like just like boom, <laughs> the shit out of You were in the shoulder when he hit you? No, nah, I was in the right lane. Uh, bro, I was what? in the right lane. Fuck, bro. Yeah, so I get fucking hit, bro. I'm like sweep, like weaving all over the highway, bro. It was oh the scariest God. moment of my life, bro. I was like swerving, and I went like the middle of like a, like a ditch, bro. How did the hood just fly on? Bro, I don't like so like my hood was like fucked up, so it was kind of like my fault in a way because like my hood, like you had to like fucking boom, like you had to slam it because um when. My brother actually crashed my car and fucking I was letting him drive it because it's thick and fucking like <laughs> he hit a another car and fucking like fucked the latch up so much. Why the not working? So you gotta really like slam that bitch closed like get it closed. Yeah. And I remember I was doing something in there checking something and I closed it but then Must have been from, when I realized I was like fuck I didn't do like the normal like fucking slam down close but it was so it fucking flew up I guess once the air just caught it. That's scary. And uh. Yeah, like I ran and I went up to the guy, I like knocked on his window, I'm like, I'm like, yo, you sitting like might be sitting there, airbags deployed, he's just like sitting like this in the car. I'm like knocking on the window, I'm like, yo, like he's like I'm like, yo, are you okay? And then he finally goes to the window then he's like, the police said to not answer any questions or do anything until they get here. I'm like, what? So he's still what? in his mind, he's still in his seatbelt and everything, bro. Just hands on the wheel with his seatbelt on. Like sitting there, bro, he wouldn't talk to me for nothing. So Straight NPC shit. What the fuck? Bro, I'm literally like, yo, like, are you good, bro? Are you okay? Like, bro, like, like you hit me. <laughs> and literally was just like, I can't say anything until the cops get here. Like, had to see bone and everything. It was weird as hell. Finally, the cops pull up, and then he's like, I'm like, yo, I'm like, what happened, man? And he's like, I don't know. He's definitely going fast. And I'm like, no shit, bro. Like, he fucking, <laughs> fucking yeah, like, just fucking did. Yeah, he just <laughs> knew it, bro. <laughs> he just smashed into like you were playing burnout, bro. Like, you just fucking took me out. Like, yeah, it was crazy. Fucking, he was lagging. His wife was so pissed, bro. She pulled up. Like, I guess they had, that was their, like, their nicer car, but they had, like, an older car, and they pulled up, and it was destroyed. Like, my car, only thing the bumper came up, but his shit was, like, fucking totally in the front. Like, it was destroyed. Oh, yeah. Bro. So, like, fucking. Definitely has fault. But she just went, I was like, I hope everything's all right. And she gave me, like, this nastiest look, bro. She bro, just, like, didn't say nothing. She just looked at me and was, like, just loaded all their shit in the back, and I was like, Fuck you. That's why, why, why are people like fucking like, your husband hitting me? Yeah, yeah like I, yeah, I, yeah, right. Then I found my bumper like fucking a little bit down the highway. I was like, yo, it's my bumper. And I made the cop get it. He didn't, he didn't <laughs> so I made him get it, and then he was like, he's like, whoa. Well, do you what, want to drive the you insurance home? thing? I did the insurance, and I was like, he's like, no. He was like, can it still drive? I was like, I think so. I was like, all right. Well, if it ain't total, then you can leave after you do bring your insurance. And I was like, I can just drive away. And leave. He's like, yeah, if you can drive away, you can just. Yeah, like he didn't want to like deal with that. I was like, yeah, uh, all right. Like I got to do the information and then just left. <laughs> it was that, but it was like the awkwardest crash ever. Like when yeah, he was just like yeah, you can you can leave it. I'm like he get out. Yeah, you are. Can't like, talk to the cops. Get here. Yeah. I was like, you sure? And I, I should I should have said like he destroyed my windshield too. Like, got a little <laughs> more break. Probably go. Could have been like yeah, hey, fucking me. Fucking me like hit this. Something happened. My hood popped up. They would have asked like how'd the windshield get damaged? Yeah, he did. He was like, what happened to the windshield? I was like, uh, yeah. I wonder if that would even be covered like under insurance. It would. Like if it was just the windshield thing, minus that. No, that would be like covered. Yeah, yeah. I think so. Dependent depending on your um like policy and shit, I know I know Geico has has uh free window windshield repair mm-hmm. for like safe light or whatever it's called. Oh my so God. a couple 
I got a couple of, uh, uh, I think, I think every insurance, uh, company does have some, some yeah. Yo, y'all want to hear another crazy story about when she was fucking? Oh, no. When I moved into the apartments with my ex when we first lived there, like, so I was just hanging around out there and she had work. I was just with my children, she got home. And, uh, I was just wandering out of the crib and I felt a fucking BB gun. Also, you know, I'm that's like, never I'm done board asses in the crib, like never, fucking shooting, like, you, you, kill, kill, like, kill bottles, like, sit shit up. Like, you find a BB bro, gun? Well, let's put it this way. Long story short, bro, I'm, like, shooting this shit around the crib, like, cool, and then, like, my dumb ass is like, I'm like, see if I can hit the other building from here, like the crossings, like see if I can reach the oh, crossings no. from here. So I'm like trying to hit a sign like on the wall, bro. I'm like, see how far I can shoot it. And I'm like, all right, I'm, like aimed it out there, and I'm just like, Pshew. and then just like it got quiet for like three seconds, and then you just hear this, whoosh, and just see somebody's back windshield just shatter. Bro, I was like, oh my god, I'm like, I'm like, I'm like hanging out the window, like like shooting it, bro, but it was. It was so delayed, bro, because I guess like it was like one of the mellet pellets, so like it hit it just right, bro, and just like you just hear the pop and then just whoosh, and just shatter. I was like, oh, oh fuck, get rid of it. it. Nah, I, I felt bad. I stayed in the house for like three hours. I was like, oh, <laughs> fuck, it wasn't me. Like my, my guilt kicked in, bro. So like, first thing, when she was blown up for like three hours, and then my guilt kicked in. I was like, nah, fuck. I was like, that was me. I'd be pissed off. I was like, I gotta go. Like, yeah. so I went to the housing place and like, I was like, yeah, I don't know, because they're, they're sponsored numbers. So I was like, fuck. Did some dumb ass shit like it was my like, he was like oh, okay like he never heard like he didn't know what to do I was like I guess like I said dumb, dumb shit yeah. he was like he was like oh man he's like he's like good luck man this guy's like he's a weirdo he's an asshole oh <laughs> no shit like we might start problems and shit I was like fuck it bro I mean I'm like I can pull my own but I'm like I just need some tell him but then I get there bro there was some chick like we walk out there and she was like she's like uh, like she just didn't care she was like eh, it's a piece of shit anyway like I don't care like, she was just so nonchalant and chill about it. I was just like. Okay. Just like your windshield, you're just like not bad. And I was like, all right. But I was like, I'll pay for it. So I went to try to go to Safeway, bro. They tried to charge me like twelve hundred, bro. Yeah, and they always. Her car wasn't even worth. She's like, my car doesn't even worth that much. And I was like, yeah. And it was during COVID, bro. So I had like uh, some like that. random guy from like Vineland to do it. He did it for like three hundred bucks too. Which was That's about normal. normal. But Safeway was trying to charge me twelve hundred dollars. I'm like, insane. yo, Damn. for an old ass like blazer, bro, like a O2 blazer. Oh come it's on! Like, it's, all, it's always the blazer. A blazer. I was like, bro, you're tripping. Like, I'm not paying twelve hundred dollars to fix a fucking. Yeah, that's insane. Bro. I threw a rock through my aunt's Mercedes Benz back window <laughs> <laughs> one time. I did. Same oh, shit God. happened. Never shattered. <laughs> totally window. shattered, and then like. <laughs> A minute later, the entire window just collapsed. Oh, uh, were you there? The no, the I shot the. Were you Me and my there? cousins were just like throwing rocks at each other in the driveway, like being retarded. And then and I it's not let go. When he, and right when I let go, I, my heart dropped, and I just watched it fly through the air, <laughs> straight through the windshield, <laughs> right through the windshield. whole thing, <laughs> spider oh, wing. Oh, yeah, oh. were you there when I shot the hockey ball through my window? Yes, I remember. That, bro. I remember. <laughs> that was your last. It was my bedroom window. I shot one. It was like, fuck! From inside the house? <laughs> no, outside the house. Uh, yeah, I shot sorry, it into my sorry. room. All the chipping from you guys hitting the balls. Oh, yeah. I was just shoot, my dad got pissed at that. And then next I know, I had like one of them stick handling balls. They're a little heavier. And I was just shooting it. And I shot it a little too high. and went straight through my window. I was like, it was like slow motion. I shot it and went, yeah, fuck. When you like let go and you see it flying towards it, it's like. It takes I, a I long went time in. for it to get there. And yeah, then, like I went into my room because it was it wasn't it was my room too. I went in the ball just sitting right in the middle of the floor. I'm like, well, I broke a window. Yeah. I called I my mom. She's like, I got break the like, window. I was like, I shot a hockey ball through it. I got <laughs> like, why are you like, shooting against the house? I got there minutes after it happened. <laughs> I, I, I saw him sitting day. there like, oh fuck. <laughs> I know Jake's dad was like, fuck the kid. Like, yeah, so yeah. Jake got beat. <laughs> With the hockey stick. Hey, with the hockey stick. With the glass. <laughs> oh, fuck, yeah. Breaking the windows oh, and stuff like that. Twitter, Your heart just, like, drops. It's like a weird feeling, bro. It's just like, yeah. fuck, like, yeah. Uh, like, I'm, in, I'm so screwed. I, I start, me and my cousin started freaking out because we were little kids when I broke my hand. And, like, <laughs> and we were, like, crying and shit. We were like, do we tell him? What do we say? Do we tell him? We, <laughs> do we tell we were going to tell him that a branch just fell out of the tree and, like, yeah. fell straight through. But then we we're like, they're going to find a rock inside the car. Like, we got to just tell them. So I got a story to touch upon about that fucking it's a little off court. But were you guys affected by that um, hurricane that came through and, like, wiped out, like, 
a lot of mud people and shit. Which oh, one? Like, like, like um, three years ago? Yeah, yeah, like yeah. Like, like, uh, the tornado? The tornado. Yeah, really yeah, yeah. I, I was not affected, wow. but oh, I was yeah. I was at the community was college five watching. minutes away from the tornado. Yeah, and it was crazy because that's when I lived in the um Yeah, it ripped through. Uh, my sister called me and she like, dude, she started crying. I was like, I think a tornado just hit the house. And I'm like, what? A tornado? I was just like, bro, when I mean, we pulled up there, it looked like so a war zone, bro. Yeah, like, this is in Denver, bro. Like, yeah. bro, trees were not bad. Yeah, right in front of the whole Denver house got blown. Bro, the tree in my front, I used to have a tree in my front yard, but that shit was down in the road. It was running my backyard down. Like, it fucking, it was crazy. I don't know how the house didn't get hit, thank God, but like, my sister literally had a fucking branch, like, in her windshield. It was crazy, oh bro. God. Like, it looked like a war zone out there, bro. In like, her windshield? Mm -hmm. Bro, like, if you drive out there now, it's completely different from how it looked when I first lived there. Like, yeah. Really, like, like when Oda got hit bad too, yeah, yeah. like the houses and fucking um, ma like same as Mantua. She said it sounded like a train. Got literally just like train. Like That's what I was described. Yeah, yeah, we did s some walking trail. It was in Monona, right? I think. The yeah, I saw, and there's a section of the trail where there's just a wide path of trees literally laying down, where you can tell exactly where the tornado yeah. went. Like, no, no, you know the one where you trail near Monona Lake. Yeah, it's like um in the woods, kind of like so you know there's Monona Lake. And then um, there's like a trail that goes off into the woods, like to the left. It's kind of like, yeah. a, I don't know where it's like, how to explain it. It's only like, if you ever heard of like Maple, maple Street. Mantua, right? Mantua got hit, yeah. yeah, 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 yeah that was the one that hot got hit the worst. worst. Yeah, you can see a lot of it. Yeah, it's, it's rough. Damage. Yeah, it's rough. It's yeah. But I was five minutes away from that tornado at college. It was my first day in person, yeah. wow. like post COVID. Like, I mean, COVID was still going on, but like right. they finally opened up the, the college to in person classes again. And it was my, one of my classes, I think it was my psychology class, she's like, I'm going to let you guys go early because the storm's really bad. That was the worst rain I think I've ever drove, up, drove in. Mm. Yeah, I mean, maybe not the worst, rough. but it was like top three. For like day. a whole ass month driving on 322, going to like the, just going the kilometer like, barrier. Yeah, just going west. Yeah, going there. It, it just, it was like a war zone. Mm -hmm. Like there was all trees just snapped straight in half. There was houses fucking destroyed with trees through the houses yep. and shit. A guy I used to work with, he, he got his house got hit really badly because he lived right in that area. As it was going on, I think we might have been sitting outside watching it. From here? No, yeah. not like the tornado. Just to oh, I was about to say like you didn't see the tornado. People from Jersey are fucking weird when it comes to the tornado. Oh, it's you're true. Either, we are. You either you either hunker down and pay, like do what you're actually supposed to, or you're sitting outside watching it. Yeah, we do that all the time, and it was a bad storm. We're like, hmm, I wonder what it's gonna do. You know, you mean you stay inside? No, nah, let's let's look outside, and watch. You gotta be proactive. You never know what that storm's gonna do. Well, the tornado was, was heading this way, and then it fucking switched direction. Tornadoes usually only last like a couple minutes, anyways. So, yeah. but that couple minutes can do a shit ton of damage. Oh, for sure. It ripped the one house right out of the ground. Yeah, uh, there was a cow farm. A bunch of the cows went missing. <laughs> I don't know if they got picked up or something. <laughs> but I don't know if the yeah, fence broke and they got out, or if they got picked up or whatever. But it's like that's the funny. Like a cow got picked up the the cow flying by. What the yeah. fuck? Yeah, it's like in the Wizard of Oz when you see all like the animals going by, and then you see the, fucking cow the girl on the broom, like you know, that would do damage. <laughs> Like I'll just, just lay in my living couch. room. One, well, you're gonna you're gonna have steaks for days though, or quite a bit. <laughs> but I hope it's good still. Yeah. yeah. Just yeah, sitting there watching a sports game next to you know, a tornado comes through and a cow lands on your TV. Yeah. The other side. How do you how do you clean that? It's scary. How do you how do you tell the insurance that happened? Yeah. You have storm cow, insurance. A cow flew through my. Do you have cow insurance? The cow flew through my That's roof probably like covered under natural disaster. I was watching yeah, a sports yeah, game. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Does, does, does my charge cover my TV? A cow landed on it. How did that cow land on it? Uh, it fl somehow it flew through the window. I got something we can talk about. Uh, you guys seen that all the Rite Aids are shutting down like yeah, everywhere? Yeah, Wait, really? Yeah, Rite Aids yeah, like going, going under right now. They just changed their symbol too, like not long ago. Like, yeah, yeah. yeah. They, they just modernized it recently, and yeah, I guess yeah. they chose to do it a little too late because they're all I don't shutting think down. They're like yeah, all that. shutting down, but I think they're massively downsizing, like closing half of their stores. One in Manchester, I think. They, were, they, they just renovated one in Williamstown a couple of years ago, and now one in the one in um. Glass I work in the pharmacy at Walmart, so. We've, every time a rating closes, one of we get one of the people that want to transfer college. all their medications to us. And Damn, it's really. like twice as busy as it was a year ago when I worked there. Damn. 
so many people. It is. It is. I'm getting out at the right time. Yeah, and then you're all old heads in there fucking they need their pills. They're like, give me my shit, dude. Oh yeah, that's Some right. They so they follow nice. chapter eleven back others, to the other days. Uh, they just get a problem yeah, every yeah. time they come up. You know, it's mm-hmm. gonna be. What's what's the one that that's what's like going over to? It's what, not a form. Oh, we'll talk about this. Yeah, yeah, this one's yeah. a different color. Yeah, it's just a different company that made it. Not TGA, probably. Same brand. And they're like, I can't take this one. We'll talk about that in a second. Yeah, another thing that's going bankrupt is Red Lobster. Same thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I didn't know that. Yeah. Yeah, Red Lobsters are starting to go away too now. Well, Gotta get the feel like every time I've been on Red Lobster in yeah. the last two years, it was I don't, dead. I don't even I don't remember the last time I've been in Red Lobster. Probably been so long. It's been a while since I've been in Red Lobster. Yeah. I don't even remember the last time I was at Red exactly. Lobster. I mean, we gotta go just for the bit, the biscuits. Yeah, the biscuits are fine. Like you don't even have to like seafood. That's the best part. Just, but make the biscuits. I feel like you just make them at this point. Yeah, yeah, the recipe is out there, mm-hmm. and sometimes like you can make it better than they can. My mom used to make them actually. Because they're yeah, probably so mass produced, like you could probably should make it with like authentic ingredients. You know, yeah, make it taste better. You know, yeah, that's true. We made some at Eric's like, house when we went to go see those here. The best is the the Texas Roadhouse. Uh, Oh, butter. Butter. Oh, the and butter. The the butter, the cinnamon butter, cinnamon cinnamon rolls. butter in the rolls. Yes, sir. They're really they're good. literally pretty much just King's Hawaiian rolls. Yeah, just bigger. Yeah, yeah. You guys like Canes? Oh, bro, oh, I love Canes. That one is different. You guys go to that one? I did go to that. I never I been to it. it. Never been to Canes? Oh. It's pretty good. I like it. I, I mean, I had Canes when I was over in Philly. Well, I want to go. Yeah, I'm gonna go to a Canes down south. Oh, I'm sure it's the same. I'm sure it's. No, it's probably better down south. I mean, so. I've never had yeah. a Canes down south. I think it's just another mass produced place that's probably the same. It's like, I don't know. Yeah. I couldn't imagine well, if it tastes, how it tastes better down south. Well, it started down south. Yeah, I know. Yeah. Waffle House tastes better yeah. the more south you go. I know that for a fact. <laughs> Some places, what? yeah, that is. How far south did you get a Waffle House? house that's better we went south in South Carolina. Carolina. Yeah, yeah. South Carolina. Yeah. So that was like pretty close to where it's peak. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I had in South Carolina too when there was in the, um, you know, the boot camp. Oh, yes. And there was like fucking like geckos or lizards like on the window while I was yep. like staring at me and shit. Just, they just out. hang out down there. Yeah, it was, it was wild, bro. It was just like. It's like, just a nice environment. I like how when storms rip through, they literally, every state like down south for hurricanes have the whole code. It's a Waffle House code. The Waffle House Index? We've talked about this before. Yeah. What is that? So you basically, it's something that FEMA actually goes by. Yeah. Since Waffle Houses are the most resilient establishment ever, they stay open for everything, the FEMA created a code for like identifying natural disasters. It's called the Waffle House Index. So basically, like, yeah. if you're in the green, then everything's normal. That means Waffle House is still open. If, yeah. they're, if they're in the yellow, you're in low supply mode. That means... Waffle like houses. the Waffle House is there, they're just limited capacity. And, and they're, they're not, open. they're yeah. not like open all the time. But then if it's in red, Get the fuck out. <laughs> yeah. yeah. If, if Waffle House, house closes, closed, yeah, that means it's closed yeah. or it's gone. Something, yeah. something fucked up is going on if it's closed. Because I'm the 24 hours, aren't they? Yeah, they're open 24 hours a day, seven days a week, no matter what. Yeah, that's nice. And if they're yeah, closed, it means get the fuck yeah, out. Yeah, if they're of closed, something at. is not good. We gotta hit a Waffle House too. Yeah, the closest there. one's in Delaware. Yeah. I have to go to Delaware. There used to be in Delaware that I used to fuck with. Actually, it was in the spot we went to. It used to be the spot we went to. Yesterday, Fud Rockers. Where? I Fud miss Fud Rockers Rocker. so much. Oh, oh shit, yeah, I remember Fud Rockers. I yeah. went to it when it was still there. Yeah, yeah. They, uh, they had one in Delaware, and now it's like a Korean hot pot place now. Is that good? I've never been in the Korean hot pot place. They're supposed oh, to be doing one in Glassboro, yeah. right down the street from us, but. Wait, is that South Korean? South. I thought it was Indian. No, no that's, that's where Steve's is. Another one, yeah. Oh, wait, what, what are you, what are you talking about? You know where the other buffet is? Like Next, across the street? Yeah, yeah. In that same yeah. yeah, they're trying to open a Korean one there. It's also an all you can eat place, but it's got like Korean hot pot. Still waiting for it to open. Yeah, that ain't ever open. I don't know if it'll ever open. Wait, do you have the Indian place? No, yeah. I couldn't tell you. I don't know if I want to try it. It'll be fine, I'm sure. I don't know. Never tried it though. It seems good though. Like I got golf today, so I don't know if I really want to try Indian food. You're yeah. golfing this heat shake, you're different. Yeah, what the hell? Yeah, it's not. Bring a wet yeah, towel or two with you. In it's 94 open. right now. In the open, it's like, gonna be 97 later. At three, it's gonna yeah, be not. in the open too. Like yeah, you got that. Fucking That's why I'm gonna be. I would suggest drinking. You gotta wear like a farmer's hat or something. Well, I would suggest drinking this. Oh, I'm, I'm so gonna drink. <laughs> You should try pickle juice. Apparently, that really helps with like what? when. Yeah. What the yeah. fuck? No, I've heard this before. It's in cramping and shit. Yeah. My, yeah. my soccer coach really? used to tell us that for cramping. Pickle juice. Pickle juice. Yeah. You know who had 
who's famous for telling his players to do that? Andy Reid did it one time. Uh, mm -hmm. The Eagles were in Dallas, and it was like 100 degrees out. Makes sense. And he had the players drink pickle juice, and they helped them win. It's because the sodium emitted. Yeah, but that was also going really against Dallas. Dallas. Yeah, but this is in the early 2000s, so like Dallas was still good. No, they weren't. I mean, they were all right. Yeah, they weren't. They fucking suck. Well, yeah, let's not the Eagles fan that Dallas was ever good. That will never end well. Yeah, no. <laughs> you are an Eagles fan. You should know this. Yeah, but like I can still admit when they're a good team. They're not. No. A, they're not a great no. team. You ever. cannot admit it. <laughs> Jay took that one to heart. Who? Okay. But Wait, I, what the fuck are you googling? Pickle, pickle juice. Pickle juice. <laughs> like, oh it, it's, it's good for elect. I'm not telling people to buy pickle juice. I'm fine. I don't know. Who's like you are? <laughs> why, it's, why it's for. I'm yeah, looking up on, yeah, there we go, National Institutes of Health. They say it's good for, like, cramps and stuff. Yeah, I think I think it's because of the sodium and stuff, but I don't know. Could yeah, I think, I think it is the sodium. Because people think, like, oh, if you eat too much sodium, you'll get dehydrated, but no. at the same time, you need to have sodium, or else you yeah. won't well, dehydrated. That's why, have you ever noticed G Gatorade? Yeah. Gatorade is... Very, it's very lightly, but it's like a little salty. Mm -hmm. But it's all the sodium in it to give you the if you the replenish. If you flush out all the sodium, though, you'll have nothing to like absorb the water. So like there is a such thing as overhydrating and drinking too much water. Yeah, yeah, definitely. So like that yeah, the sodium in there. Yeah, there's something that happens with that. It's like something with your fucking cells and shit. Yeah, your cells color. explode because they just fill up with water because there's not enough salt to kind of dilute them. Yeah, apparently you don't want your piss to be like completely clear. Yeah, because that means you're too hydrated, like overhydrated. Like clear. You piss also is don't fine. want it like yeah. bright fucking yellow. No, you <laughs> want it like a clear yellow. Yeah. But, like, if it's like you're pissing water, then it usually means you drank too much. I mean, I, I piss water sometimes. <laughs> I piss water sometimes. <laughs> like, okay, I'm not. I'm just going to stop. <laughs> like, I got nothing. I'm just not going to touch that. What's up? Hey. What's up? Welcome to that one show. We're talking about what color our piss is. Oh, my piss. Was <laughs> so light. So like, light. Uh, highlighter <clears throat> yellow green color because what? I took a multi. Oh, and yeah, you had just yeah. woken up, so. Yeah, morning because we were talking about how. So, like, I. When you're dehydrated and cramping. Like, when I'm drinking, so it's oh, yeah. crystal clear. Salt, dude. But yeah. then the morning. Yeah, if you drink too much water, you're it's just gonna right like, flush out all your shit. That's what I was like. Dehydrated as fuck. I swear to God, I ever get cramps really often, but. I drink so much water, I don't know. My dad used to just put salt kind of, in my water for some I think I kind of slowed down on energy drinks for now. Yeah. Because when I did, I just started smelling like, smell like bacon. You know what it, oh, it didn't, like, it wasn't like a good bacon. It wasn't a good, I don't think anything smelling like bacon is, aside from bacon. Okay, 100% bacon. Yeah. He's probably burning the shadow of the... Yeah. He just went... <laughs> oh, he's here? Yeah. Oh, shit. That's a good spot? Yeah. <laughs> it's fine. You could just... Where's his car? At my house. Oh. Yeah, he's yeah. like... Yeah, we went to we went to fucking um <laughs> we went to House of Brews last night and then ended up at Rax. Yeah, I see. And then, and followed, then you were in the middle of a fucking intersection at the red light. Yeah. Yeah. Wait, what was that about? I don't know. What do you mean you don't know? I was a little rushing to get home. I don't fucking know. I had a mean chest pump today. Shout out to working out. <laughs> I gotta get back into the. I'm back in it. You are? Let's yeah. go. Oh, there you go. Damn. Yeah, get fucking big, little guy. That's what I'm trying to fucking do, motherfucker. <laughs> 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 Your dad is gigantic. Uh, yeah. You can be huge as shit, and you just don't go to the gym. I got a little depth in my arms right now, but like, it's not... Yeah. <laughs> I, like, no matter what I do, it doesn't fucking do anything. If you do just anything. went to the gym no, for no, a year, you you'd gym. be fucking Yeah, shredded. I probably would. I don't want it. You oh, don't want it. Well, there you no, go. No, I actually well, got back. Well, then you don't want it. No. I'm getting back. back. You'd, you'd, be like, fuck just too, huh? you'd be like really I vain. Dude, he'd be like Why? this all the time, I don't want to be like that. Why? I don't want to be veiny. Why not? Bro, this is like... Oh, no, veiny like, look weird. This is all I've ever wanted not to like, look like in my life. Not like steroids-y veiny. <laughs> you know, like, you know my, dad look, my dad looks fucking... You don't want to be like your dad? You don't want to be like that? Gross sometimes. You don't want to be... What the fuck? I'll put your dad's Instagram in the link. Your dad looks great for his age, though. I don't care. Yeah. I mean, yeah. Listen. I'm going to look like that to the Wait, you're shit. putting it in the fucking link thing? Hey, do you want... Do you want, do you want me to link your wait, dad? Wait, wait, wait. Which one did you... Which one are you putting in there? Why is your dad have more followers than you? Dad, that's so funny. 
Dude, what the fuck? Jacked, that's why. Yeah, you I don't want know. More followers? Oh, you're putting his Jeep one in. What do you mean his Jeep one? This is his normal one. No, he has one. two. Oh. It's a mix of everything. You get to know the I daily life. Dude, he made two. Oh. Smith oh. Smith he made oh, one great, for actually. his Jeep. Definitely. I'm just gonna call it Jeep. Yeah, really? Yeah, I'll go. Yeah. I'm off. Well, I'm off a lot. Yeah. But Monday afternoon, I'm supposed to go to my brother-in-law's. I think I'm off Tuesday, too. Which is that also, I'm going to ask my friend if he can cover my ship for the beach tomorrow. Oh, sick. Let's go. Yeah, I'm, yeah, I'm we talked about the beach earlier. We're, we're going to go buy a whole other can of sunscreen. <laughs> we'll do that whole one when we're there. It's, it's going to be 97 degrees. Dude, today. the uh, index has got to be like 100. <laughs> Yo, who put uh, AJ sunblock on? Who put AJ sunblock Who fucked up my sunblock? Yeah, yeah. I had like He literally just has a fucking squiggle on his back. Yeah, everything's all mixed well, up. Well, I mean, I did do your back and I asked Everything you if I covered it. You said yes. <laughs> it felt like it. I don't, I don't, I it was either thought. you were lit or a mixture. It's literally just a fucking squiggle. I did that and then I was like. <laughs> we all thought we covered. Like, yeah, we all got we all covered. It didn't matter. We all got covered. It was fun. We were fucking with AJ at the pool the other day. We were like, yo, who put your sunblock on, dude? It looked like a fucking snake was on my Because he had, he, like, its shoulders were red, but like right here was just white, and then it was just a white, thick squiggle line all the way down his back. I'm so <laughs> <fucking shit. laughs> oh my god! I'm wearing a shirt tomorrow, actually. I'm wearing a shirt. I'm just gonna I wear a long sleeve, like a thin long sleeve. Whatever. I'm bringing a skinboard. Oh, hell yeah! I'm bringing a skinboard. We can bring shade. We can bring shade. Dark and have tent. Yeah, Dark and Lauren have a pop up tent, dude. Please bring that. I um, don't know. I can bring Warren, that's it? Probably I can bring one. something. I can probably find like an umbrella. They have a pretty, I think they have a pretty big one. <laughs> yeah, we, we don't have a pop up tent. Oh, wait. <coughs> oh, no, we do have one, but I don't know. <coughs> we got to get it out again. Tickle in my throat. <coughs> must be air down going? here. <laughs> uh, it's, it's, it's incense. Oh, it's not going anywhere. Who's, yeah. all, who's, who's all, all going? going? We're, We're all going. going. Yeah. We're all I mean, going. I'm like the four of us if he gets all. Yeah. yeah. Plus lid. We'll say you're going. Eric, Lauren, and George, and, right? and, George and, and Devin if he's going. I'm so trying to get. I'm trying to get Megan and the baby to go. <laughs> I don't know Good if luck with that. Though. Please no. Uh, it's tomorrow. She's not gonna go. Like no, I told. I told her. I was like, it is the beach. It is. I don't know if you're gonna go. Oh well, yeah. <laughs> Who wants <laughs> dirty hands? <laughs> <laughs> All right. Anything uh, else you uh, want to bring up? Right? What? The beach? Yeah. 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 Oh yeah. This is no, I think I'm. Chad, I need to get another car for the beach. Oh, oh Trump's in Philly. I mean, Trump is in Philly. I mean, we were gonna go to Assad no, today, but I don't know if we should do that now. We could do that. Hey, you know he's not gonna be there late. late. You're right. He's got a bedtime. He does got a bedtime. Oh, and plus, he's got to and plus where Assad's at, I doubt the fucking all the uh, crazy Dude, Trump guys are gonna be like, in Assad's at it. Yeah. They probably know. think it's gross because they're racist. Okay. Oh, well, I do. But it's so it small. opens at three and he starts yeah, at seven. Like, the one that goes, he, well, he might be the there a while. That one. The one that's going right that's across your visor. Yeah, bad thing bad thing at in all. Philly. I just got the one big one. That's what he's probably going to be like, I love you, Philly. Everyone's got veins in different spots, I guess. Yeah. But that's the like Eagles really are the best football team. Right, you're like, that's awesome. It looks like, yeah. Yeah. slice your dart. <laughs> <laughs> it looks like one paper I'm down to go. Yeah. Like, what, what team do you think Trump supports, like, football-wise? Football? Not that was. Probably New York. Probably New He's probably a Jets He probably is a Jets fan. Yeah, he's a big New York guy. I think he started over New York. Yeah, he's from New York. <laughs> yeah, he's definitely a Jets fan, and he just doesn't talk about it, or he doesn't care about football. You probably don't. I feel like that's more, yeah. more plausible. Because you never see him in football about. games and stuff. He's at wrestling recently. He's been to yeah, other yeah, really good. He goes to USC, football. a lot of USC. Well, yeah, yeah. yeah. He, he does, does like uh, Dana yeah. White loves him. And him yeah. and Dana are really good friends. Yeah, yeah, like, Dana White friends. doesn't yeah. give a fuck either. He's like, yeah, that man's helped me out so much in my life, and like when people told me not to go speak for him, I told him, fuck you. Yeah, Trump had a lot of supporters Dana before White. politics. Like everyone was friends with him. Because yeah. Dana White actually had a like a sponsor for the no, UFC yeah, yeah. because he put he posted something with Trump, and they're like, take that down now. And he, he goes, who the fuck are you telling yeah. me that what well, I'm allowed to post? Trump was also one of the first like, people that's one that of like, my friends. Like, <laughs> yeah. Lent him the space all to the like, like have the UFC. UFC. Yeah, like, they're all they're literally walking up their heads. It's are all like wild individuals. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, like they just don't give a fuck. The amount, of, the amount of bets that like Joe Rogan. Rogan. Yeah, yeah, that's great. Yeah, yeah. Rogan. Joe Rogan was tough. Yeah, I fuck with Joe Rogan. His podcast was tough too. Oh yeah. 
October. It was a lot of shit. interesting stuff, at yeah. least. He goes everything from very, comedians very to like people that are huge conspiracy theories, and yeah. he just yeah, or even people that study mushrooms and shit. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It li- yeah. he'll yeah. literally get them high and just <laughs> or fucking or let them or talk. Cobalt, like for your fucking battery in your phone. You should look into that because it's terrible. Wait, really? People are slaving in the Congo really bad. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I'm talking about that. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. And I don't I want to talk about it. Like, Tim Cook has to fucking know about it. Kids and shit. Bro. Every he iPhone, knows. every car battery, bro, like, that shit is. Kids and shit, bro. Like, yeah, bro. Like, mom's on their back with a kid, and they're 14 years old. And they're just mm-hmm. fucking hitting the fucking rocks with a pickaxe. No, like, really. all day, every day for a dollar a day. It's rough, bro. <laughs> like, that's insane. Mm hmm. Like, that's real. People don't even realize that. There's this company in China, I forget yeah. what it's called. And they're all Chinese companies. Yeah. There's no, no American companies there. Oh, uh, what's the... Mm, that's what hold on. Yeah. There was one, and then what's they sold it for like $2 billion, called? and now it's like... It's like really not. <laughs> I didn't even know... That, like, like, Elon's, Elon's actually trying, trying to make... A battery. Foxconn, that's it. Yeah. Do you guys know what Foxconn is? No. I've heard of it. It's this know. company in China that Apple, like, directly works with. That makes all their phones, and they work, like, so many hours yes. a day. Yeah, and they don't get many breaks. See, I now, mean, Elon has cut the Cobol, like, in half for the cars and shit, and they're trying to work on cobalt free batteries and shit. So at least he's trying. He's but, trying, like, but there's just so many issues I like the, with, like, uh, working with... I like the Rogan podcast where you Elon one and you got Eli high. Elon. Elon. <laughs> Eli. <laughs> Elon. He He's got, got Elon, Elon on there high. like four times. Yeah. And he got him high every time. He started like. They always smoke on there. Him, Joey Diaz, like all those people. Uh, Rick Flair. That's a blank <laughs> website. That's I watched one with Rick Flair. That was cool. He's old as fuck. He, yeah. The ones with Joey Diaz are funny as shit. Blue shoes. <laughs> 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 yeah. Is it's funny. Like they tell us, they tell a story because like, like they're all all those comedians are like really close friends. And Joey Diaz is the one that will be like, oh yeah, it's only 10 milligram. Next thing you know, it's a fucking 200 milligram edible, and you're fucked up. These edibles ain't shit. <laughs> no, there ain't anything. And then I think I think Tom Segura has it in his special. He goes, don't trust your friend. I have this friend, Joey Diaz, and... I have this he, friend named Sully. Yeah, he goes <laughs> like that. Hey, Sully is right. the Joey Sully Diaz of our friend. Sully is the Joey Diaz of Team AGF. Like, telling stories and shit. Yeah. yeah. Just being funny up all the time, ripping yeah. dabs, and... <laughs> He smoked plastic. No, I, I hit his fucking yeah, dad yeah, and then died. died. So, did you yeah. hear that story, Sully? One time he had his... Yeah, I've heard of that. Yeah, I've heard of that. And he was, <laughs> he was doing a dab out of, like, the container with the wax in it, the little uh, plastic yeah, container. Yeah, yeah. And he, he does that all the it. time, apparently. But he went too deep, and oh, it melted through the plastic. He so, and he so, hit, and his he smoked plastic. And his head was hurting, like, crazy. Just toxins, dude. He was going to smoke all the time. <laughs> yeah, I know. Smoking plastic and shit. Like, he's he's a big realizing toxic. that he threw yeah. away and the plastic was melted. He is literally our, our Joey Diaz. Yes. You don't take anything from him or you're going to fucking die. I'll just throw his naps, too. I know, dude. Yeah, like, so rough, my bro. chest would be fucked up. I feel like a sharp pain last time. Yes. Was, like, my shit was like, bro, I was coughing that, bro. I was like, <gasps> yeah. my breath, it was like, somebody was like, like standing yeah, my chest. Yeah. Heart attack, bro. Like, that shit hurts. crazy, bro. I hit, like, he, he, the one day, he was like, he was like, I never smoked with me. He hit, hit my pen. And that was a thing I never am going to do ever again. Take something from Sully. <laughs> I never take a pen. Congrats, you learned. I went like that. Yeah, you learned. And then as soon as I blew out, I went, what? Just basically, I sat here and just head down and just Whoa. fell the fuck asleep. I was dead. That's just because you don't ever smoke. Yeah, I'll never smoke it. I fucking smoked whatever Sully had in it. Was that when me. you had the Burger King? Or no. Or? No, that was a different The time Burger there. King was, I uh, we were, I joined in the smoke session with the Blunts. Oh, that's right, yeah. That and was someone was trying though. to teach me how to do it. I was like, dude, I know. I know how to do it. Man, Jake, there was a fight at uh, Rax and shit. You missed it. Huh? There was a fight at Rax. There was a fight? That's what Versus 3 said. It said, Grip just ripped some of this guy's shoe off mid-fight. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, I, I did that. that. I didn't know the context behind that. I would have complained about that. Anything else you guys want to bring up? Uh, no, man. All right, we've been going a little long, so we can wrap it up here. Yeah. I got one thing to plug real quick. Sometime this week, uh, Team AGF Super Bowl 21 is going up. Chris versus Seth. It was kind of a meme. Oh, yeah. Go watch it. It was a fun time. It Give me that. It was, was Chris own fault. It was a good. Chris sucks. It's not spoiling anything. Just, yeah, watch yeah, it. just watch it. Just watch it. Yeah. Chris did, did Chris thing. Did Chris do did shit ton of trick plays again? There's a lot of ups and downs <laughs> in, in the video. <laughs> Yeah. Well, t- you just gotta watch it. It started out great. <laughs> oh, yeah, it started off great. Then it got a, a little me me towards the end. So, what's good to get out of here now? Tip your delivery drive. Tip your delivery drive $5 today. Yes, please. sir.